I've been moving around with George and sparring, you know, probably since I was the younger days of my boxing career. And I must say, he has come a long way to be a world-class professional athlete. As we all know, he's an absolutely workhorse. Um, I've done a lot of rounds with George in this, in this preparation for his fight. I must say, like, I'm a lot bigger and stronger, and the way he can hold me off, he's very fast, he's quick and he's sharp. I'm backing him for this, I believe in him. I believe in him because in, in his, he's so confident. I feel he's got the ability and the skills to pull this off. You don't do your weight right, and you know, if you're really suffering to make weight, it can, take a, it can take a toll in your body in the later rounds of a fight, you know what I mean? You know, Lopez does look big, and, and if you hear all the rumors he struggles with weight, that's a, that's a great advantage for George, you know what I mean? Where George is comfortable, he's coming in at a healthy weight, feeling good, rehydrating well. Where Lopez might be drained, he might be dangerous for maybe four to six rounds. And if you know George can stay smart for those six rounds and come on top of the next half of the fight, you know George has a real strong chance of winning. Look, I'm at a level where I, I try, um, I try, not, I try to stay away from gym walls, but as my natural ability. I'm always going in for the attack. You know what I mean? I'm always putting the pressure on, I'm always banging hard. And, um, you know, George handled that really well, very well. Hey, hey. I've seen George spar 12 rounds and he's, he's ready to go another 12. So that's, that's a big advantage, you know what I mean? He's, he's, he's got all the advantages at him. He's confident, he's fit, he's fast, he's got the speed, he's got the footwork. Um, he's got it all there. People sometimes say the dad is power, but George is very sharp where he can sting you. His punches, his hand speed is very sharp. He can catch you off guard and you know, he can wear you down. You know, you'd think they'd be preparing 100% for George because I know George is, you know, he's 100%, but um, you just don't know. You know, if it is taken lightly, better for George, you know what I'm saying? So, like, it's, it's going to be a hard fight for Lopez. It's not going to be a walk in the park. You know, George is not going to be there to be hit. He's going to be moved, he's going to be creating angles. He's going to be hard to hit, so um, Lopez want to be on his game for the whole rounds of the fight. I think George in the later rounds, you know what I mean, going the distance, or it could be even a late stoppage if you know Lopez is worn out, fatigued, and I think George can get the better of him. Yeah. God willing, George is successful, man. He puts puts Australian boxing back on the map, man, and it'll be great opportunities. You'll create a lot, great opportunities for a lot of other boxers defending those belts here. You know, it could be amazing shows here in Australia, amazing shows. So it's a victory for everyone. Yeah.